so today what I have going on is I'm installing the flooring it's only quarter inch Luon that you can see what it has a beautiful shine because I applied two coats of polyurethane and after it's installed on I'll install I'll uh, paint another coat of polyurethane I'm gonna be leaving the floorboards so that is my foundation um, as you can see from these little white spots, yellowish spots in between the cracks. What I did before I laid down these floorboards was I used great stuff and in, uh, I foamed, that's this stuff. Um, it's a spray expanding foam, weather tight. I sprayed that in between. And uh, so what I'll do is I'll go down and make more lines of that and then I'll lay in my last sheet on top. That's what I've got going on. I have these on a hinge. The screws are very small, but this is only half inch plywood. They came through a little bit. I can just double those with some uh, silicone so that my mattress doesn't catch it. But I put the two hinges on there and voila, it opens. Look at, I'm too close. Look at that. It opens. I'm very excited and it closes. I've got a lip all the way around so that the other table can rest down on it and then in the front just because it's uniform and then I'll do the same on this side so this extra I got three pieces that I made the same and this top this piece will be the table that rests down inside of that oh I'm very excited look at that let me see here stand back wow look at that sink I made. I brought it inside so that it's square and plumb on the tile floor. It's about 36 and a half inches high. I raised it a little bit above regular countertop height because I prefer them a little bit taller. Um, these are just uh, one by, excuse me, two by two square posts that I cut down I've got four legs the same height. I've got two the same size this way and matching two up here. And of course two this way and matching two at the top. I am not going to be using the sink clips that come with the uh, sink. Right now this is literally just resting in here but I have the uh, framing in such a way that it's snug right up against there so the sink doesn't wiggle in its base it's uh, it's wedged in between these rails so I don't need the full circle here you see the the framing is a little bit behind there I did want sturdy so I went with the wider even though it was going to cut into the hole there a little bit you see how it cuts into the hole but um, I prefer it that way because uh, I could always just carve that out a little bit if I stick in my um, handle and I'll put my bucket underneath it. I'll build, uh, uh, I'll hang a jug of water above it or else I'll just build another little table next to it that I can um, pour right into it. So I don't need to have actual plumbing for this first trip that I'll be taking soon. I'll probably put a plywood siding on it. Actually, I want to wait to see how heavy 
the camper is when I finish it before I put on any additional uh, cabinet framing. So right now it's just going to look like that. I'm very excited. It's plum. It's squared. Uh, I like it. Thanks very much for watching.